Yes, the great wiener dog race of 2024 at the Pan American Center at halftime in New Mexico State, Western Kentucky tonight. That dog has wheels. Chloe, your weenie winner tonight in what, what appeared to be about 2.35 seconds flat. I think it was the bandana. Congratulations to Chloe. Well, New Mexico State is in an interesting place, not nearly as interesting as Chloe. Early in Conference USA action, the Aggies have looked fantastic anytime they're at home at the Pan American Center, but are winless away from Las Cruces. Good for them then that tonight's very important Conference USA clash with Western Kentucky was in their own barn because the Aggies needed all kinds of magic tonight. Let's take it out to the Pan American Center, a battle of two first year head coaches, Jason Hoot, New Mexico State, Steve Lutz at Western Kentucky. The Hilltoppers entered this one in second place in the league. Let's uh, get it going here. The Aggies got off to a slow start. The Hilltoppers taking advantage. It's Rodney Howard down low. They were out to a 15 to 4 lead 13 29 to go. That's Jordan Rawls as they try to start tip, chipping away and then Femi Odukali inside for the Aggies in the first half. Western Kentucky now this is Christian Lander with a nice pass to Tyrone Marshall as he sinks the three. They would go into halftime with the 37 27 lead. Western Kentucky would put his foot on the gas pedal in the second half to start things off. They built a 23 points second half lead but then the Aggies started to chip away again it's Casey Eziagu the slam dunk then moments later Jordan Rawls gonna find Jaden Harris in the corner tray ball corner pocket suddenly the Aggies down just three with six minutes to go 430 to go they're down six here it's Harris again with another triple NMSU with tons of momentum Babacar Faye inside for the two-handed jam Western Kentucky trying to close this thing out this is Tanaj Petway back the other way for the Aggies Look at him driving baseline, the up and in with the left hand and one finish as well as the Aggies draw a little bit closer. This is Howard for Western Kentucky making a free throw here to tie the game up at 70 after the Aggies took the lead at the free throw line and then under 15 to go. Femi Odukale looking like he's at Rucker Park, the left handed finish. That gave the Aggies the lead for good with four seconds to go. The Aggies rally for a 72 to 70 victory from 23 points down has to be one of the biggest comeback wins in history at New Mexico State. So they're now eight and 10, two and one in Conference USA play. We will hear from Jason Hooten and company on this comeback victory tomorrow on KTSM.